Hi guys. Um, so first of all, I just want to apologize overall for this setting. Um, the first video I did of this didn't work out that well. In fact, like the sound was like really, really broken on it. So I'm trying again in hopes that it's fixed, but it might not be. Um, I'm sorry it's dark. The lighting in this room sucks. And I'm kind of sorry for the TV in the background, but I'm using the sound to kind of drown out, drown out my own sound from going outside my room, if that makes any sense. So, I don't know. I hope this kind of works out. But, um, so this video in particular is going to be about social life, first semester, freshman year. Um, I made some notes, but there's not really much to go off of. Um, I talked about classes in the previous video, so um, you can go check that out if you're interested in hearing about what my classes are like. Um, but the main thing I have to say in terms of social life, your first semester at college is to um, take advantage of what you have. Um, you're not going to be in like the upper level hard courses yet, and so the courses you're taking um, is likely a large amount of material you would have learned in high school. So if that's the case, then you probably will not be studying as much as you will be in the future years. Because um, I know that was the case for me. Um, like I got to college and I was like, whoa, like maybe I will have life, a life. Like it's not like as bad as they say it is, but um, I mean, it kind of is when you get up in classes, but I would say for now to just kind of, um, if you're going into college, just take advantage of it. Um, but remember to keep in mind that you do have classes to focus on. Don't let your GPA drop. Don't go out when you're supposed to be studying for a test. Like, it's really, really important that you keep good grades. Um, you want to be getting mostly A's with a couple of B's and try to avoid C's like as much as possible. Um, you definitely probably don't want your average ever to drop below a 3.5 um, is what I would say because if you let it drop below that then you just have to play catch up and there's just that adds more pressure and stress and it's just not really worth it. You should just tr keep it good from the beginning. Um, so, yeah, the main thing I would say about social life is just go out and make friends. What doesn't matter, like, where they are, um, making friends in pre-med is good, making friends outside of pre-med is good, making older friends is good, especially in pre-med. Um, most of my friends aren't in pre-med, um, because I was in a program that didn't involve pre-med, so, um, I would say, like, well, I have more friends in pre-med now, so I would say that now my friends are, um, probably like 85% not pre-med and all of my close friends are not pre-med. I don't have one close friend at school that is pre-med. Um, so like it's not good or bad to have friends either way. Just make some friends, go out, have some fun. Um, if your school has a pre-med advisor, go see him or her, but um, they're probably just going to tell you like the, ge the general things you should be doing, keep your grades up, volunteer, get, like, clinical experience, stuff like that, and all that is true, but, um, what I would say to do your first semester is to find out specifically what your school does to help pre-meds, what kind of experiences are around, um, because each school is different, each school has, like, your school might have, like, some special program that you won't know about, and it's good that you find out about it early so you can plan what you want to do, um, if there's a pre-med club, go check it out. That's a good way to make, like, older pre-med friends. Um, and in terms of community service, um, I would say get involved with a couple of things, but really just take the time to just try things out. Like, don't worry about, like, getting involved in some major project your first semester at college. Like, go um, try habit Habitat for Humanity. Try Soup Kitchen. Like, try whatever you want. And, um... I wouldn't even say that it's necessary to like volunteer in a hospital your first semester, um, just because like it going to college is a whole brand new experience and it's something to get adjusted to. So your first semester, I would just focus on finding things 
in the campus community that you enjoy and then the next semester branching out so that is what I would say mostly to focus on is just to stay within campus find your comfort zone within campus before branching out and going other places and being wild everywhere um, so yeah with that being said the main thing I have to say about first semester is to have fun with it because it's not gonna last long I mean I'm still having fun in what I'm doing but it's different fun than you might want or expect you definitely have to sacrifice a lot as a pre-med um, but I wouldn't trade it for anything so um, I hope this is helpful um, hopefully within the next few days I will be doing sophomore year um, I start training for my job on Saturday so there will be more information about that and that's really it so um, again I'm sorry this quality is really really stinky but it won't be like this again I hope um, so I will talk to you later comment subscribe if you're pre-med let me know how you're doing what you're doing um, I love to hear from other people in the pre-med community so yeah, that's really it. Okay, bye.